Welcome back guys, um, kind of at the halfway point of Bright Lights and Flying City, maybe not even the half because I have no clue how far in we're actually close enough to get to our sanctuary, or get to our friends, let's get some ammo, just about everything, um, okay, so let's see. A reminder to all Hyperion robots. Any and all supply drops lost to pressure attacks Oops. will be taken out of your theoretical pay. Theoretical pay. Man, okay, so right away it's giving us tons and tons of ammo and grenades. I have a feeling something big is gonna happen here. Oh shit. Oh. Oh man, not these guys again. Any Hyperion robot able to terminate a pressure will be awarded with the ability to be proud of on. the fact that they terminated a pressure. There we go. Okay, some robots nearby. I'm detecting a car in the area. The XP loader. Well, that was close. I think another one's coming away. Some more of those. A baby in tears. If the previous statements elicit yes. emotional reaction, report to your supervisor for summary destruction. Okay, let's keep moving on. Gets all the oh, rocket ammo, please and thank you. There's still much more to be discovered here. Loader, please do not okay. Mode until moving a sufficient distance from Hyperion machinery. Uh, sometimes I really hate how, like, when you're aiming at a piece of ammo and you just don't pick it up because you're not pointing at it directly, it can be a little bit annoying. So then you end up thinking, oh, okay, I, I'm full ammo, I don't need anything here. And then you take one look at your uh, your numbers and you realize that you barely have anything left and you're just like, what the hell? What the ass? You know? Whoa. This guy here. Some more ammo. What is this? What is going on here? Are we gonna go forward? Yes, we are. Okay, cool. Okay, we don't want to jump. This will give us a better view of anything that we're missing as well. Hmm. Self awareness, kind of like Terminator. Okay, just jumping right off. Do you see those lunar supply shots? You need to steal a lunar supply beacon and get the moon base to send you an uncalibrated fast travel unit. You can use that to get Sanctuary mm. back on the fast travel network. A reminder Simple. All Except robots. not at all. Any and all supply drops okay. Pressure attacks will be taken out of your theoretical. So, where, where do we go now? I guess we have to go over there. Um. Okay. There must be another entrance over here. And some more enemies, of course. What is... Oh, Constructor. What the hell? Shoots out turrets, really? Okay, we gotta get rid of these guys first. Damn it. The reason why I want to get rid of those, uh... These guys, the surveyors, because they just take down our shields really quick. Holy shit. Okay, he shoots missiles. He shoots missiles. Well, we can do that too. Here we go. Holy crap. Holy shit. It's those uh, suiciders. Okay, now that all of them are out of the way, we can continue trying to blow this uh, constructor up. Here we go. Whoa, that is one big missile. 
Holy crap! Oh! What the hell? Well, at least it's done and over with. It's kind of like a mini nuke. Let me drop. Bounce of eggs. Uh, okay. Is there anything else we're missing? Any Hyperion robot able to Orbital receiving and processing. Will be awarded with the ability to be proud of the fact that they terminated a pressure. All right, let's just keep some of our stuff reloaded. Just reloaded. Only like got four rockets left. I guess that'll be all right. Hoping we don't find any more constructors. Okay. This is a really big area to uh, explore over here. Apparently, there's a beacon over there that's telling me to go on over there. But first, again, just want to do a quick check behind everything. A lot of open space. Can't really be too sure. But there's some shit to find. Um. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna assume there's nothing here. If you guys find anything, let me know. I would appreciate it a lot. Oh, I was wrong. Never mind. That's actually the beacons. Okay, down there's the beacon. Some money and some money. Alright, let's get back to where we were supposed to go. Whoa, whoa, what the? What? A gluttonous thresher. Oh man. Oh, that's great. Now. Did that thresher just eat the beacon? Yeah, that's great, isn't it? Oh shit! Okay, well, I'm gonna go ahead and. Oh! I'm gonna try to recharge. Yep, that thresher just ate my shit. Oh, you shit! God, I can't wait to finally throw dual grenade or double grenades. That's gonna be extremely useful. It's kinda like tremors, you gotta stay off the, the dirt. Down to hard ground. Never mind, that doesn't apply. Shit. And he's just gaining his shield, like, right away. Come on. There we go. Huh, it seems like he's not moving. Yes! I think him just staying there frozen just helped us out a lot. Okay, got a leading shield and the lunar supply beacon, which we need. You got the beacon? Good. Yeah. We can use that to request an uncalibrated fast travel unit from the moon base. Still got some enemies here. Place to set Ooh, up the beacon. Sputtering spitter. Head to the town of Overlook. Thanks to Hyperion's mining operations, the people of Overlook suffer from the skull shivers. They won't disturb <laughs> us. Medic. Okay, well he dropped a, he dropped some items, but check it out real quick. And the exit seems to be right over there, so perfect. We actually picked up another rifle, which is uh, the Sputtering Spitter, which we had a lot earlier in the game. Level 17, wow. But the damage is, I don't believe the damage is all that, wa all that well. But, of course, oh, this is a well, bursty type weapon. no plan to stop Jack, but at least the quakes from his drills aren't shaking the city anymore. Silver linings, you know? Oh yeah. I can't believe Jack was controlling the angel all along. We almost got killed open in the vault, just so he could bring that son of a bitch into power. Well, now we're almost getting killed just to get him out of power. Pretty much. Nice to know some things never change. But anyways, um, as I was saying, this weapon is more of a burst, um, single, uh, single fire weapon, but. Um, that sputtering spitter is fully automatic and shoots explosive rounds. It kind of gradually gets faster as you're oh, holding down the so button. Kind of like a minigun. don't get about you bad guys. You know the hero's gonna win, but you just don't die quickly. 
Man, uh, example, this one guy in New Haven, right? City's burning, people are dying left and right, yada, yada, yada. This jackal rushes me with a spoon. <laughs> a freaking spoon, and I'm dying laughing, right? So I scoop out his stupid little eyeballs with it, and his kids are all, oh, yeah. oh man. And I, <laughs> wow, what a sp That was so messed up. Oh, come on, really? Let's get these things first. And I really thought we could have just went right in here with the vehicle, but apparently not. And it just kind of disappears Mega Man style. Got more people shooting on our right side. Oh shit. I kind of assumed that we had some uh, grenades, but apparently not. Oh, that was stupid. Okay. Man, is it me or are these guys are a lot stronger? Oh, of course, they're level 19, I'm level 16. I can explain why. A lot, way, a lot more dangerous. But uh, that's why I'm saying. I mean, uh, am I supposed to go in here on foot? I'm not sure. Let me check the map really quick. Well, yeah, it says I'm supposed to go through there. Oh man, am I supposed to go there on foot? Or can I just ride around the area? I'm not sure. Let me take care of these guys first. Oh, I'm not dead. Alright. Yeah, I'm supposed to go this way. I think those guys, those first few guys, were just really strong. Oh man, okay. I am running out of ammo very easily. Let's get some more reinforcements here. Okay. Hopefully we don't I think as if we see those skulls, that skull icon next to the uh the enemy, then that's probably um that kind of means they're an elite version of their former self. Just like that guy, he has a skull right next to his name. There we go. Oh yeah, he's bleeding now. Oh. That's a really groovy way to die. Oh boy. Okay, these badass loaders is just not gonna make it possible for me, so let's go ahead and gain some distance, shoot some rockets. Oh my god. Not enough damage. And I think this game really urged the need for co-op for sure. I can do this. Alright, let's just keep our distance. There we go. Little by little. That'll do. And half health. Okay. We're almost down. Almost there. Oh shit, that ammo. Oh crap. Oh man, just like that. Okay. 
Oh no. Okay, well. Seeing as that and knowing I can't kill this guy, I'm just gonna kinda skip it really quick and just go right where we left off.